Okay, everybody, welcome back. So after last week, did anyone manage to get any practice in? Mm. Yeah, I'm not convinced, not convinced. Okay, so um, this week, um, we're gonna, again, keep going with our uh, ground strokes, so forehands and backhands, trying to develop them a little bit further, but we're really gonna put that into points play or games play by doing a lot of doubles. Okay, so we're gonna work on tactics, where to stand in doubles, and actually playing the game. So first thing we'll do is get warmed up. So we're gonna go uh, into our sort of little mini bump rallies. We're gonna go diagonally. So we're really practicing the forehand and backhand. Okay, so when you're ready, um, let's make our way back towards the baseline again. Do it from where you're most comfortable. Let's see how far back we can go. Let's see if we can get right to the back of the court and get that rally going. When we go to play, um, you must start um, each rally with a serve. Okay, everyone, well done, warm up done. So uh, let's crack on with the main theme, doubles play and some doubles tactics. Uh, so we're gonna start off with our court positioning for doubles. This is our court setup. So we've got the receiving team and the serving team. We're looking for hopefully Jackson to pluck a volley out of the air. Anyone know what a volley is? So, yeah, great. So when we hit the ball without a bounce, I'm going to serve again. So we would switch sides. The serving team switch sides. Ah, aha. Uh -huh. And the receiving team move backwards and forwards. So Sam, you would move back, toy up to the line, stop. And we would go again. Great serve, Johanna. So Rosie, move a little bit closer. Abby, stay up here where you are. Stay there and go, go, go. Try and stay on your side. Okay, so everything from the line to the line, yeah. right to the back, even over your head, this is your half. Okay. okay, and Rosie, that is your half. So try not to meet in the middle. If Hannah covers your side, yeah, then it make sure it you there. cover her side. Yeah, right. Okay, because yeah, if that yeah. had gone over, it would have been quite tricky because we had no one on this half of the court. Oh, it's a diddly one. Up you go, up you go. So then both come in, both come in and volley, both go in and, ah. Oh. So great effort to run all the way up here. Yeah to play your shot, yeah. but then it's actually a really good position. If yeah. both of you had a stayed up here for the volley, yeah. that's a really strong oh, position to be in. Back. Here we go. That's it, hold your position. Well done, good point. How everyone held their positions. Okay, so we're gonna finish with uh, a doubles match. Okay, but I'm, I want you guys, I want you to call out the score. And it's not traditional scoring, one, two, three. Um, the points work uh, slightly differently. So, you know, if you win the first point in your game, you score 15. If you win the next point, you score 30. The next point, you score 40. If you win again after 40, you win the game. If it gets to 40, 40, that's juice. And you need to win by two clear points to win a game. So it goes advantage, game. 15, 30. Well done. Whoa, so what's the, sc what's the score? Ah, uh, what do we get for the first point? 15, love, 15, love. High five. <laughs> well done. There you go, over your head, let's talk. Volley. Okay, switch sides. Okay, team, so well done, except both of you ended up on this side, which meant if that shot had gone over, you were struggling. Okay, everyone, well done. So we covered, again, we went over our ground strokes, forehand and backhand, cross court, some rallying, doubles tactics, doubles positioning, and doubles matches. So how did we get on there? Did we? Yes, yeah, yeah, good. Yeah. Good yeah, we'd certainly look competitive there. <laughs> Plenty of practice for next week. Well done, and see you all then. Great, well done. Well done, team. <laughs>